Hi, this is JP from Not Alive Over Arkham. Welcome to another Eye of Chaos playthrough where I pick a random investigator, build a chaos deck for that investigator, and try to do the best I can in the Midnight Mass scenario. Let's hop right over to picking our unlucky investigator this time. Um, there haven't been that many rogues or secrets in this series yet, so I'm hoping to get one of those, or a survivor actually. Well, we'll see what we get, so uh, I'll pick a uh, investigator from my uh, token bag, where I have the investigator tokens, and this time we get uh, Ashkan Pete. Well, it's a survivor, and an interesting survivor, so uh, Ashkan Pete is a Dunwich investigator, so we will be getting the Dunwich splash to this investigator. So let's hop over to ArkhamDB.com and create the Chaos deck for Ashkan. Okay, and we are over on ArkhamDB.com and let's pick Ashkan Pete. Build the deck, so hoping to get some good ways to get clues, but Ashkan has a built-in uh, clue getting uh, engine and fighting engine in Duke. So let's see what else we get into the deck. Okay, uh, let's start from the assets. So we have a bunch of as hand assets. We have the uh, 18 Derringer, which is, it is a good fighting uh, weapon for true solo. Then we have the fire axe, which is a staple for most many Ascan builds. Uh, we have one flashlight, which is good for investigating. We have a knuckle duster, uh, not that good in Ascan. Mariner's compass, again, might be okay, but probably not that good. Uh, meat cleaver, not good. Newspaper really good for Ashkan and for this scenario. Old Keyring, this is a really good seeker investigating tech. Uh, so a lot of choices. So for hand two slots we have 145 Winchester and as I'm not playing Taboo, uh, this hasn't been updated to the Taboo, so this is a garbage card. Uh, Dragon Pole not good for Ashkan. Allies, we have Granny Orn, okay for Ashkan. Madame Labranche, really good for Ashkan. If we would have the, uh, what's it called? I, I can't remember the card's name off, off the top of my head at the moment, but uh, the, the one that if you don't have resources, then it is really good. You get plus one to every stat, I think. Yeah, so uh, back to the card. So we have Mysterious Raven, that is a really good card. Uh, Professor William Webb, Dig Deep, Governor's uh, Catalog, not good. Uh, look what I found. This is a really good investigating card for Ashcan. Cunning Distraction, not that interested in that fight or flight. Uh, it's a decent card. Fallout, not that good. Fortuous Discovery, times one, uh, times two, so maybe useful, probably not. Improvised Weapon, not that interested. Occult Invocation, uh, not good for Ashcan. Oops, not good any in any deck, I think, except Stella. Uh, Waylay, okay, with Ascan's agility. Will to survive, mm, okay, or decent. Uh, skills we have Desperate Search, not that interested in that. Run for your life, not that interested. And uh, well, those were all, all the skills we had, so let's see the weakness. Again, I'm rolling, re rolling if we get something that doesn't work. Uh, rap uh, Silver Twilight Acolyte, so that is an, an, a weakness we can have. So, well, that is the deck. So, this has 
potential, I think. We'll see if, uh, if we draw the correct cards. This could be an okay uh, deck for this playthrough, but we'll see. Okay, so the deck looks decent enough. Nothing special, really good investigative and fighting tools. But we have Duke, so we should be uh, able to investigate either way and fight either way. But anything that helps is good. But we'll build the deck and see how this goes, so let's get started. Okay, and we are ready to begin, so I have built the deck. We'll see how this goes. We'll start by drawing our opening hand. Let's see. Hope, hope to get some good cards, so we get uh, the weakness, so we redraw. Another weakness, so we redraw. Oops, Scoffner's Catalog. Fight or Flight, Flashlight and Run for your life, so... Uh, these all can go away. One, two... Three, four, keep the flashlight. So, Mysterious Raven, Newspaper, Cunning Distraction, Dragon Ball, and Flashlight. So, I was hoping to get a decent weapon. Uh, Dragon Ball is not a decent weapon. At least we got the Mysterious Raven, which lets us get a difficult clue when we need to. And, uh, Newspaper is good. We are probably spending the clues quite quick. So I think the first turn will be quite fast with the help of Duke. So we'll just quickly shuffle the deck. Here we go. So um, first action I'll play the newspaper. I will investigate um, and uh, I'm investigating 4 versus 2. We fail, and I'll investigate again. Four versus two. We are reading the newspaper to try to figure out what's going on. It is a zero, so we grab this clue. So the newspaper is offline, but next round we can uh, use Duke to move and investigate the river town. So no enemies will go to upkeep. Uh, Winchester, not the card I was looking for, and we gain a resource, so... Uh, a resource, not a doom. So that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We get a doom. One of six. First encounter card of the game. <laughs> Hunting Night Count. Okay, well... This is a problematic enemy. Well, first action. We will exhaust Duke. Fight uh, four versus four versus three. It is an elder sign. Uh, ready, Duke. Nice. So we deal two damage. Second action. We'll fight with Duke. Actually, I'm committing this, uh, not this, but uh, cunning distraction. No dragon pole. So we are fighting five versus three. <laughs> it is a minus three. Oh dear. Uh, last action, we will try to evade. Uh, four versus... Four versus one. Minus two, because we double it. But we still succeed, so at least we get to fight another round. So, no enemy actions. Uh, Night count is exhausted. We'll go to upkeep. We ready. Card draw... Coffiner's catalog and we gain a resource. So that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We get a doom, two of six, and count card is the wizard of the order. Well, we are only 
apparently drawing enemies. So Wizard of the Order, we spawn it at River Town because we want to go there and defeat it as fast as possible. At the end of the middle space, it gets one Doom on it. And first action will exhaust you to fight the Knight Count. And we are fighting for versus. Mm, four versus three will go five versus three again. Actually, we really well, we are will go four versus three. no five versus three minus two. So that's good. We committed that because now the knight count is this, uh, defeated. Then we will, as a fast action, discard a card from our hand. We discard the Winchester to ready an asset. A duke is an asset, so we can ready. Uh, second action, we'll move to River Town. So this engages us. Last action. Oh yeah, we will move with duke and fight. So uh, we are fighting four versus four versus uh, four. So this should uh, this could fail, but it is what it is. We have to try. So four versus four uh, minus one. So we fail, unfortunately. And last action, we will. Try to evade this enemy. Uh, four versus two. Minus three, we fail. So, failing all around. So, enemy face, the wizard of the order, hits us for one damage. We take it on Ashkan. We ready up. Uh, we draw a card, Bracked by Nightmares, exhaust all assets you control and put Bracked by Nightmares into play in your threat area. Assets you control cannot be, cannot ready, discard Bracked by Nightmares, double action. Well, uh, this is uh, starting to look really bad, but we'll see how this continues. So that is that round. Let's, oh yeah, we get one resource also, which doesn't do anything at the moment. So that is that round. Let's go to the next round. Okay, uh, we'll add a doom, then counter card is another enemy. Well, of course it is. So uh, we'll spawn the Acolyte to the graveyard. It gets one doom on it. Uh, well, we need to hit this guy twice. Without Duke. It's not looking good. So. Uh, I think we are trying to... We'll, we will evade. Let's think. Uh, we have five Doom on the table. Next round we get the Mask Hunter. So even if we don't get rid of this... Uh... Yeah, well, we start by evading. Four versus two. Nothing to commit. Oh yeah, there should be a two here. Four versus two. Minus two, we at least evade this guy. So, uh, let's think. If we do the double action, at least then we have Duke. But that doesn't do us a lot of good. But... Uh, I think there's nothing else we can do. So double action will get rid of Wrecked by Nightmares. So we ready. Duke. No, we, we don't have any actions left. So... Yeah, well... This, this is a bad situation. This is turning out to be a really short game. So, unfortunately so, because I was really hoping this deck would do well. 
we'll go to upkey uh, enemy phase nothing happens in the enemy phase upkeep we ready so this guy engages us again and we draw a card improvised weapon and we gain a resource so that is that round let's go to the next round uh, we had a doom so the agenda advances unfortunately we get the mask hunter already so that was a really quick uh, first agenda so the mask hunter engages us We draw an encounter card, please don't be an enemy. It is hunted by uh, um, hunting shadow. Um, at this point, I really have to just lose the uh, clue. So I spent one clue and not take any damage. So, what can we do? Uh, the mask hunter is a tough one, but I think we need to get rid of the. Oh yeah, at the end of the Mythos phase, the Wizard of the Order gets a Doom. So... I will fight with Duke and fight against the Wizard of the Order. So we exhaust Duke. Zero, so a lucky break, so the wizard is dead. Now we need to deal with the mask hunter. So I will discard the improvised weapon. I will ready duke. I will play the improvised weapon from my discard. So it gets shuffled into my deck, it cost one resource. Uh, the Mask Hunter gets minus one fight, so I'm fighting, I'm using Duke to fight. No, I'm not, but this deals two damage. Uh, I don't think this is a good idea. Let's, uh, okay, yeah, I, I already shuffled the deck, so I'm <laughs> committed to playing like this. So I'm fighting two versus three, unless we get really lucky, then uh, this is a dud. Minus one, we miss. Uh, last action, we will evade four versus two. We should have just fought with Duke, but... I, I messed it up. I forgot Ash can, can't use to, to fight if playing the improvised weapon. So, uh, 4 versus 4, minus 1, we evade at least. And that is our turn. No enemy actions will go to upkeep. Uh, the mask hunter readies. We draw Madame LeBronge and we gain a resource. So, that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We add a Doom. Uh, one of eight encounter card is another acolyte. How are we only drawing enemies? That that is unbelievable. But it is Arkham. Uh, we'll spawn it to East Town. I probably will go there at some point. And it gets a doom. Okay. Well, we will. Fight the mass counter. I'm using Duke. We are fighting four versus four. Zero. We deal two damage. Only need four more damage. I will discard uh, Skofner's catalog to ready Duke. Uh, I will fight with Duke again. 4 versus 4. Minus 1. We fail. 
Uh, last action, we will try to evade 4 versus 4, 2. Plus 1, where were you at the last draw? So, at least we evade. We can try again next round, but I think this is taking way too long. But we'll see. So, no enemy actions will go to upkeep. Uh, everything ready. We draw a card, old key ring, only intellect icons, and we gain a resource. And that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We add a Doom, 2 of 8, encounter card for this round is... Mysterious Chanting. Well, the mass counter gets 2 Doom on top of everything. First action, we will uh, exhaust Duke to attack, 4 versus 4. 0, we hit. We have a chance. We will discard, um, I will discard the flashlight and ready Duke. We will fight with Duke again. 4 versus 4. Come on, Elder Sign. Auto fail. Well, we will evade. 4 versus 2. Minus four, we fail. Enemy phase. Um, the mass counter hits us for two damage. And one horror. That is the enemy phase. We'll go to upkeep, we ready. We draw a card. Knuckle duster, at least a fight symbol. And we gain a resource. So that is that round, let's go to the next round. We get a Doom, uh, 3, 4, 5, 6 of 8 encounter card is on Wings of Darkness. Uh, we are testing 4 versus 4. Minus 2, we fail, we take 1 damage and 1 horror. I'll put them on Duke. Okay, we'll... Uh, first action will fight, will commit the knuckle duster. So I'm 5 versus 4, fighting with Duke. Please let this hit so I can get rid of this mass counter. Dude. Elder sign, ready Duke. We are getting somewhere. So the mass counter goes into the victor display. Finally. Then we get rid of a couple of Doom. Uh, we will use Duke to move and fight this Acolyte. Um, should I have... I, uh, yeah, let's do that as the last action. So, uh, I will investigate with the newspaper. I will commit Madame Lebranche to the test. So I'm investigating uh, 5 versus 1. Minus 2, we get this clue. Last action, now we use Duke. So we exhaust Duke, move here. This guy engages us. Uh, the Doom went somewhere. They should have a Doom on it. Okay. So, uh, we are fighting 4 versus 3. Minus 3, we fail. So this guy hits us for 1 damage. And that is it, so we ready up. We draw a card, uh, followed, and we gain a resource. And that is that round. Let's go to the next round. Oh yeah, we should be over here. There should be a clue here. So let's go to the next round. Okay, uh, we add a Doom. So 4, 5 of 8 and counter card is Mysterious Chanting. So this guy gets 
plus two doom. So next round, if we don't defeat this guy this round, that is game over. So uh, first action, we fight with two, three versus one. Should we play followed? No, that is useless. Okay, uh, three versus one. Minus three. We'll discard that to ready Duke. We fight again. Three versus one. Minus three. We'll try to fight again. So two versus three. And if we fail, this is game over. It is an auto fail, of course. So uh, the cultist hits us for one damage. We are one damage away from getting defeated, and uh, we'll just play it out. So we ready up, we draw a card, we gain a resource, and we go to the next round where we will add a doom. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we doom out and get resolution too. So not a good game. Uh, the problem here was that we only only basically drew enemies and uh, got double mysterious chanting, which was bad. So yeah, that, this was a horrid game with uh, Ashken. I I had so such high hopes for this deck, but it was not meant to be. So well, we at least defeated one uh, cultist enemy. So, so uh, we had Mass Hunter in the victory display, so that is two uh, victory points, but only one uh, cult, uh, cultist enemy defeated. But still, uh, this is uh, Chaos and Arkham for you. Uh, hope you guys like this playthrough. Thanks for watching, and until next time.